Dead name me at your wedding, have fun eating cake off the floor, and the groom is coming with me. Part 2 halves, so I was at the wedding, right after at least 3 or 4 of Marla's family members had dead named me, when Marla's sister, whom I'd met multiple times, came up to me and also did it. I put on a really tight smile and asked her why the name change, since I've met Marla's sister before and she always addressed me correctly, and she basically says that, now that our families are joined, there's no reason to pretend to play along anymore, and that my mental illness would be soon corrected. She even had the audacity to wink at me as she was saying it, and I was fuming, at first, I didn't want to cause a scene or even tell my brother, but after I went to the bathroom and broke down in front of my mom, she told me that this is something we need to discuss with him immediately. So, the two of us went and found him, and he was not happy, I've never seen him look so upset, but he didn't wait for a single second, he told me to go ahead and that he was going to be leaving this wedding too, and since I was the person who baked, iced, and decorated the entire wedding cake, I only thought it was fitting that I take the cake with me when I left. A bunch of caterers tried to stop me, though, so that's when my mom grabbed the stand and pushed it to the ground, she's so dramatic, but I love her so much for that very reason, it's safe to say that the cake was completely ruined, but it gets better, because remember how Marla's family was conservative, it turns out that she kept those beliefs in bed, too, which means that Marla and my brother never had sex, and since my brother left before their wedding night, they've never consummated the marriage, he's going to get their marriage annulled very soon, and I could not feel more loved, take that, Marla.